Tell me about India. It must have come home especially to you because you're now practicing Hindu? Well, I practice. I mean, I practice at a lot of things. Hinduism is something that I'm very intrigued by. Namaste, mere dosto. Hope all is well. Today, we are going to watch a fascinating video on surprising celebrities who practice and respect Hinduism, and also the former president Trump's thoughts on Hinduism. We all know that Sanatana Dharma is rapidly growing in the United States. So I'm curious about this video. So let's take a look. 10 surprising celebrities who practiced Hinduism. Hinduism's teachings have long drawn individuals from all across the world, including many celebrities. Only you have the power to change your beliefs and others should not motivate you to do so. Take a peek at these famous people. One, Julia Roberts. The appeal of Hinduism is no less infectious than Julia Roberts' smile. When she traveled to India to film Eat, Pray, Love, she came into close contact with the world's oldest surviving religion, which wowed her. Roberts, who was raised by a Catholic mother and a Baptist father, is said to have developed an interest in Hinduism so after seeing a painting her. of the Hindu god Hanuman. She actually chose to become a Christian. There has been no turning back since then. Roberts continues to be a devout Hindu. She admitted that she is now more sympathetic and loving as a result of it. Is that something that she still does? Diwali should be Celtic. Roberts was quoted as saying just before Diwali. Two, Hugh Jackman. Jackman may play Wolverine for the rest of the world, but he is profoundly wow, rooted in Hugh Hinduism. He has admitted him. in numerous occasions that mysticism appeals to him. He is a devout follower of Hindu scriptures, such as the Upanishads and the Bhagavad Gita. The scriptures that we follow are a hybrid of the West and the East, and would range from Socrates to the Upanishads, to the Bhagavad Gita, to a variety of other texts, he stated in an interview. The actress, who was raised as a Christian, also wears a wedding ring with a Sanskrit Ooh. inscription that reads Om Paramarmanamar, which translates to, we commit our relationship to a I higher source. I think that's source. the right pronunciation, Three, but that's pretty cool. Miley Cyrus. Miley Cyrus may be a global musical sensation, but if there's one thing she cherishes, it's an ancient religion system wow, known as Hinduism. I did not know that Cyrus about that. is a well-known pop singer and actress all. who is known for her provocative work. However, she realized that practicing Hinduism could be the best thing for her to change that troubled inner being. Cyrus is known around the world as a pop sensation with scandalous lyrics, but those in her inner circle know her as a devout Hindu. In fact, she recently uploaded the photo of Lakshmi Puja in her home to help her with her finances. On her Instagram account, she posted a photo of the entire set. Hashtag Fruit Bowl over Super Bowl. The 24-year-old singer captioned the photo. Four, Sylvester Stallone. Really? The performer, who is best known for his part in Rambo, has a fascinating backstory. He lost his kid four years ago, and he has been aware of his mm. son's spirit ever since. After becoming extremely troubled, he sought the advice of a priest who instructed him to perform Pin Don for his son, a rite that allows the deceased to achieve moksha. The Pin Don was then performed at Sadi Gad in Kankal near Haridwar by Stalin's complete family, including his brother Ooh, Michael Stalin, his wife Mitchell, cringe. Russian My movie star Alexei, and that. his wife <laughs> Olga. Stalin's trust in Hinduism has been <sighs> rock firm since this happened. 5. Russell Brand Oh, I Russell knew Brand, that. A well-known comedian knew that. and actor was initiated into Hinduism by not, that's not shocking at all. Hinduism is something that Brand is quite interested in. Brand could not be a better example of how one's religious beliefs are reflected in the practices one observes at their wedding. He not only married in India, the birthplace of the religion he so admires, but his religious beliefs are so strong that he married Katy Perry in a Hindu wedding in Rajasthan. Before they tied the knot, there was a Hindu priest who made them execute all of the procedures. Uh. 6. Steve Jobs The name Steve Jobs is self-explanatory as the founder of Apple. He is the greatest entrepreneur of all time. Many of us are unaware that Jobs was a strong believer in karma, which was likely a factor in his success. Karma is the result of our deeds, which we cannot avoid. Hence, one must always be faithful to his or her conscience. When we consider that a guy of Steve Jobs' stature has spent his entire life according to the karma principle, we are filled with joy. Needless to say, karma is associated with Hinduism, indicating that Steve Jobs was also a fan of Hindu philosophy. Of course, this is nothing new since Hinduism has attracted believers mm. from all over the world. Steve Jobs, the man who really changed the way how we communicate, yeah, had visited India in search of enlightenment. In the due course of his stay, 
he paid a visit to the famous Baba uh. named Karali Ashram to understand the true teachings of Gosh, Sanatana so Dharma. Lucky. Seven, Max Zuckerberg. Mark Zuckerberg just recently revealed that he visited the ashram in the early days of Facebook on the advice mm. of one of his mentors, Apple founder Steve Jobs. Jobs had visited here as a college student in the 1970s, and Zuckerberg believed it would be a wonderful place for him to think about the future of his firm, he added. The Riverside Retreat in Utherakhan has quietly attracted other tech heavyweights from Google, Apple, and eBay over the years. It is now enjoying its moment in the spotlight, courtesy to Zuckerberg's visit to India this week. Indian media descended in droves. Attendance tripled. Train and busloads of curiosity seekers from other parts of India began arriving, hoping to get a look at what is now being called the Zuckerberg <laughs> Temple. As no. with hundreds of other ashrams and spiritual centers in India, Western backpackers and tourists have come to Kainsha for decades. Eight Madonna, Muslim pop diva Dia has come under assault from Britain's largest Islamic <laughs> council, which believes she is an Hindu. After causing a stir in the Muslim community, with her burqa bikini display. The Muslim Madonna, who was born in Norway, made headlines a few months ago when she revealed she had received death threats after her latest video showed her removing her burqa to expose a sexy <laughs> bikini. The Muslim Council of Britain, MCB, believes Dia is actually a Hindu and is lying about her faith. Deepika Thathol is her true name. That is unmistakably a Hindu name, not a Muslim one. We have a feeling this is all a publicity hoax, a MCB said. 9. Richard here. Crowds expecting to hear the Dalai Lama oh, speak at the Newman's Institute either. were surprised mm -mm. by Hollywood actor Richard Gere. He spoke during the opening all of an integrated Tibet yoga center. Too. Mr. Gere he's said that he was on the verge of running Tibet. here from the airport. Always Despite been very the outrageous violence, them. he stressed in his short remarks that America was still open to different cultures. He also dubbed the Nimmin's doctors pioneers for bringing science and contemplative religions yep. like Buddhism and ancient tradition together. The Dalai Lama, who spoke after, asked people to not follow faith blindly and to always question and investigate, as that was the Buddhist way. He said that ancient psychology in India was so evolved that modern psychology comparatively was equal huh. to the kindergarten level. 10. Claudia Cisla. Claudia Cisla, a German actress, supermodel, and singer, is said to always carry a Ganges statue given to her by her Vedic astrologer, which she claims brings her good luck. I adore Hinduism's tolerance and peaceful thinking. She is supposed to have said, I've gone to a lot of temples and prayed, which has given me a lot of hope and new energy. Rajan Zed, a renowned Hindu statesman, praised Sisla's interest in Hinduism and encouraged her to learn more about the world's oldest and third largest religion, which is rich in philosophical thought. Don't know anything Rajan about Zed, her. the president of the Universal Society of Hinduism, said today in a statement in Nevada, USA, that if she required any help with her Hinduism studies, he or other Hindu experts would gladly assist her. Cecilor recently starred as Linda in the reincarnation-themed murder thriller Karma and Mar Shah Jahan. She's also appeared in the Italian sitcom Outsiders in Palermo. She is a German journalist who has acted as the lead in the Punjabi film mm. Kai Jana Parts, Why Go Abroad? Besides Bollywood, she is claimed to be getting offers from regional Indian cinema like Tamil, wow. Bengali, Punjabi, and Marathi. She is reportedly Catholic. Cecilia said that she liked Hinduism very much and had discussed about Hindu topics such as reincarnation. Oh, she's Catholic, Thanks a lot for watching. Mm -hmm. That's all for today. I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Have you ever thought of converting to Hinduism? Uh, converting is such a bad word. Why do they use that word? So we're here at an event of the Hindu Republican Coalition in New Jersey, and I have with me Donald Trump himself, as well as Shelly Kumar, who's the organizer of this entire event. Mr. Trump, thanks so much for talking Thank to you. NDTV. Great honor. Thank you. What brings you to the Hindu Republican Coalition? Well, I have event? great respect for Hindus. I have so many friends that are Hindu, and they are great people, amazing entrepreneurs. A lot of people don't understand. They are amazing entrepreneurs. But why only Hindus? Because Indians include Muslims as well. So well, is, no, there, look, is there I, any exclusion? I'll be honest. I have great respect for India. Okay. And it, I actually have jobs going up in India right now, and, and it, tremendous yeah, jobs, great tremendously to invest in successful. India. But I have great respect for India. It's an amazing country. Now, terrorism is one of the key focuses of this event, and you're going to be speaking about this as well. You've been very strong on, on uh, what you call radical Islamic terror. Right. How are you planning to make 
America safe from radical Islamic terror? Well, we have to be very, very careful. We have to have extreme vetting when okay. we let people in. You know, we've had tremendous problems, whether it's in Orlando or in San Bernardino and all the different places, mm -hmm. including the World Trade Center, of course. Right. So we have to be extremely careful, extremely strong and smart, and we're going to uh, do extreme vetting. I mean, when people come into the country, we're going to have, Definitely we want true. people to come into yeah. the country, but they have to come in legally. Wow, so interesting. I did not know so many famous people were practicing Hinduism. The beauty of that is that Hindus never try to convert anyone. So they are just following it naturally, without any force. Hinduism is the best way of life, so I can understand why they feel so much connection to it. It is not an easy path to follow, but it is the most rewarding one. The more you go deeper into it, the stronger the vibrations become and the more you feel connected to the universe and life itself. Sanatana Dharma also is one of the few ways of life that lives in harmony with Mother Nature and considers the divine feminine an essential part of creation itself. Now on Trump's statement, I'm so happy that he supports Hindus openly. Even in India nowadays, people hesitate to give open support to Hindus. I did not know about that. Well, I hope you guys love these amazing facts about celebrities that practice Hinduism. If you have more suggestions for videos, please let me know in the comments section. See you in the next video. Ram Ram.